taken the ELT out of the tray, and here's the tray. So they've already made some holes, so it should be pretty easy. So now we want to line up the middle. So these two holes in the back are good, but it looks like there's none up against close to this side. So we're going to want to move it over a little bit. So now there's one, and there's one. So that should work. Alright, so I've got the tray in. I already have one screw in. Um, it appears I didn't need to countersink them after all. I just deferred them a little bit, but I didn't need to. So, get that step. Because the, the ELT isn't even going to touch anywhere, so I could use round heads if I wanted to, or as some people call them, button heads. So you want to try and square it up there. Looks pretty even. Actually, you want to, yeah. So you want to line it up with that. Now we're gonna, I'm gonna put a hole here, here, and here. All right, so I have the plate in. So now I'm going to put the lock nuts on the bottom. You need to make sure your screws aren't too far um, to this piece right here, to the piece right here, or it will, or the nut won't have room to get in. Right. So now I have my, my socket. I'm gonna hold it right there. All right, so I got myself a, a ratchet. Just make sure, just hold it, and make sure it goes like that. Make sure it tightens right, and then it clicks when it's going left. So you know it's going the right way. Now, just push down on this one. Make sure the socket's on there. And then go like this. Since that, until it's not too tight, you can go like that. It's really easy. You can turn the screwdriver, you don't even have to move the ratchet. There, it's getting a little too tight to do that. So now I'll hold it with that. Get the screwdriver and tighten just very briefly with the ratchet. All right, and there. So now, look how sturdy that thing is. It's not going anywhere, even with just that. All right, now I'll get my other two screws. Again. I'll finish this up. Just gonna tighten that. Now I'm gonna take off this screw. Oh wait. That one is on because I forgot to put on this piece as you guys are probably in the video um, saying hey you forgot to put on that piece well I did just kind of an annoying piece in the way but I'm going to see if maybe there's a way I can get it on without having to take that whole thing apart Looks like there's a way. There's always a way, it's just a complicated way or easier way. Oh, I think I found a way. There we go. So I got it. Yep, it worked. So, I'm not going to have to take out the piece. I felt really stupid in the video. I mean, I already did, but... Alright, got 
that that's screwed. Tighten again. I'm just going to finish tightening up. Tightening up the screw. Don't over tighten it. You will strip the threads. All right. Get on there. And now I'm going to get the EMT. I'm going to place it in there just to make sure it fits. So just loosen that up. Voila. Thanks, guys, for watching the video. Hopefully, it was helpful. Um, uh, I'll show a picture after this. I'll show a picture of the ELT in place and the antenna, just so you can see how how um, nice they're put in. Hopefully it was good. Um, please comment and subscribe. I'll see you in the next video.